Have you ever pondered whether magnets can lose their magnetism over time? It's a question that has intrigued many, from curious minds to seasoned scientists. Magnets, with their invisible force fields, seem to hold a kind of magic. But like all things in this universe, magnets too are subject to change. Certain factors can influence a magnet's strength, causing it to weaken over time. What might these factors be? And can we do anything to slow this process down? Dive into this magnetic mystery with us as we unravel the truth. Several factors can cause a magnet to lose its magnetism. Let's explore them. Heat, electromagnetic fields, and external conditions are the main culprits. When magnets are exposed to high temperatures, the heat causes their atoms to move more rapidly. This frantic movement disrupts the alignment of magnetic domains within the material. These domains are regions where the magnetic orientations of atoms are aligned. When they're disrupted, the overall magnetic strength of the magnet diminishes. Then there are electromagnetic fields. These invisible forces can play havoc with a magnet's strength. When a magnet is exposed to a strong electromagnetic field, it can disturb the alignment of the magnetic domains, much like heat does. This causes the magnet to lose some, if not all, of its magnetism. External conditions also play a significant role. Physical shocks, such as drops or collisions, can lead to demagnetization. Even storing a magnet inappropriately can harm its magnetic strength. For instance, aligning a magnet in the wrong orientation can gradually cause it to lose its magnetism. So you see, our magnets are at the mercy of several external factors. Now that we've identified the culprits, you might be wondering, how long does magnetism really last? Well, the lifespan of a magnet isn't set in stone. It's highly dependent on the factors we've just discussed. For instance, some types of magnets, like those made from samarium cobalt, can gradually lose nearly half their strength over a span of 700 years. That's a long time, isn't it? But here's a silver lining. The magnets we use today, made from modern materials, are less likely to lose their magnetism due to collisions. Thanks to advancements in technology, we've been able to create materials that are more resilient and can maintain their magnetic properties for longer periods of time. So while magnets do lose their magnetism over time, it's often a slow process that takes place over hundreds of years. As we've seen, magnets do lose their magnetism, but it's not a simple process. This dance of magnetism is influenced by a myriad of factors. Heat, for instance, can cause magnets to gradually lose their magnetic properties. Electromagnetic fields, too, play a notable role in this intricate ballet of atoms and fields, potentially accelerating the rate at which magnets lose their magnetism. Then there are external conditions. These could be anything from temperature changes to collisions, each contributing in its own unique way to the slow demagnetization process. But let's not forget about the materials themselves. Modern materials like samarium cobalt and neodymium iron boron are less prone to demagnetization due to their high coercivity. In the grand scheme of things, magnetism is a delicate balance, a dance of atoms and fields that we're only just beginning to understand. So, next time you use a magnet, remember the intricate dance of atoms and fields that keeps its magical powers alive. Until then, stay curious and keep exploring.